Can you just tell us how hard it is to be a black Muslim man in football? I got away with it. First, because I played in countries where there is not too much racism. Second, because I've been a top player everywhere I've been. So usually when you're a top player, they don't treat you the same. But when I see people get treated like this, you know, it's just foolish that you receive racial abuse like this and you get banned because you react. You know, I had the chance to go to RS Roma before I leave Chelsea and the only reason I didn't go it was because of this, because I can hear here and there that in Italy it's a lot of it. I know my character, if I get fed up of this, I just leave the country and it's not something you have to do. So I said, okay, let's stay, in, let, let's stay where I'm safe in England where people are nice and more tolerant at least than in some other country. It's tough. It's not as tough as being an Arab Muslim, but it's tough because they go through worse than us. Like I say, it's education once again. If we want to change the mentality, we have to educate the kids. They're going to be the future of this world. So if we don't educate them, we won't get rid of it. If you don't have the good education, it's impossible.